Last thing before we go tonight is about that guy, Ohio Democratic Congressman Tim Ryan. Ryan has been a guest on this broadcast. Ryan is a 10-term member of Congress, not without political ambition. He ran unsuccessfully to replace Pelosi as House Speaker, ran for president last time around with the same result. He is currently mulling a Senate run to replace the retiring Rob Portman, who morphed from a Trump, a Bush Republican to a Trumper almost overnight. And while Josh Hawley of Stanford and Yale and Ted Cruz of Princeton and Harvard and the Ritz-Carlton have flirted with branding the GOP as the working class blue collar party, Tim Ryan is from the blue collar belt of Northeast Ohio. His district runs from Akron to Youngstown. He is fond of saying he is in Congress to represent the people who shower at the end of their workday and not at the start. And today, during a debate over labor unions and American workers, he appeared to have reached his limit with the Republicans. Heaven forbid we pass something that's going to help the damn workers in the United States of America. Heaven forbid we tilt the balance that has been going in the wrong direction for 50 years. We talk about pensions, you complain. We talk about the minimum wage increase, you complain. We talk about giving them the right to organize, you complain. But if we were passing a tax cut here, you'd be all getting in line to vote yes for it. Now stop talking about Dr. Seuss and start working with us on behalf of the American workers. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank all of you out there. Thank you as always. Thanks to at home. Thanks for watching. Thank you so much for letting us into your homes during these extraordinary times.